Yeah, hi, uh, my name is Mark Castaldo. I'm the uh, producer of the uh, inspiring documentary, My Run, narrated by Billy Bob Thornton. Hello, I'm Christine Redlin. I'm the co-producer on the picture and also oversee the promotion of marketing when we come to town for film festivals. Well, the story is about uh, Terry Hitchcock. Uh, Terry Hitchcock had lost his wife to breast cancer and he had to raise his three small kids. Um, he shepherded them to be teenagers and when they got to uh, uh, be grown-ups, he wanted to give back and do something for single parents and something to honor his wife. Um, his wife had died of breast cancer, so what he did is he wanted to run 75 consecutive marathons in 75 days to bring awareness and honor his wife. And he did that uh, to the 1996 Olympics uh, from St. Paul, Minnesota uh, down to the Atlanta Olympics. Uh, over 2,000 miles, one marathon every day. And we have to say it's just such an amazing uh, story. It's touching so many lives as we go along the festival circuit with our run for my run. And uh, we've had some wonderful responses from the community talking about that they were touched by the story in some way, shape, or form. And kind of the metaphor of, you know, the marathon of life and also to be somebody's hero. And that's very important. And is this really, is this the first film you guys have put together? No, um, it's the first documentary that I produced. Uh, okay. I've produced uh, narrative features uh, for Lifetime and uh, HBO. And uh, so this is the first documentary, and it's a whole different animal, but it's been uh, very rewarding. So you guys have been in the film industry for quite a while then? Yeah, uh, absolutely. And, uh, and go ahead and just any order on um, where are you guys from originally? So. Okay. I'm originally, originally from uh, New York, and uh, I've been I would have guessed that. Yeah, actually. I would have guessed that. <laughs> yeah. And I've been Australia. out in uh, L.A. for about uh, 16 years now. Okay. I'm uh, from the Windy City in Chicago, and I've uh, been in the Los Angeles area for about 25 years now, and started really like in high school performing in theater and then working in different capacities in the industry ever since then. Yeah. And then yeah. is this your first trip up to Big Bear? Yes, it is. No. I've never been here before. She's been here. I've been here, yeah. yes, several times before. It's been a few years that I've uh, been up here, but it, one thing we really enjoy about the film festival uh, experience is the community gets so involved in uh, Monica and her team. The volunteers are so gracious and classy and nice. I mean, they treat everyone just wonderfully and, uh, you know, we really Every time we come to a, uh, a town for a film festival, I always reach out to the community to get involved and come to see the festival, whether it's runners, faith-based people, breast cancer support, cancer support people. You know, we get them to come out and support the fest and see this film. And now, oh, go ahead. It, it's been a, a great inspirational film, and getting to know Terry Hitchcock um, has really uh, given us all filmmakers uh, something to think about, about uh, giving back and uh, trying to make uh, somebody's lives uh, a little better. And are you guys have uh, uh, any current projects going on right now, or are you just mainly working on promoting this particular project? Well, th this is key. We're promoting this. We have a few more festivals to go. We're talking to some distributors that are interested for a, a possible theatrical release with it, a city by city kind of tour type of thing. We're uh, discussing that. But you know, we always have uh, films uh, that we're prepping and hoping to do uh, later uh, later in the year. And then just a question from, because I saw you guys yesterday at the car show, uh, I don't know if you guys, did you guys vote in the car show? Yeah, yeah we, we did. did. We, and then what, got, was, what we, was your favorite car in the car show? Just we we yeah. both oh, got, got the, the uh, T-Bird. The T-Bird. <laughs> Me too, that red T-Bird. Uh -huh. wow, I have your name and the name of the film that you have here at the festival. Well, my name is Tim Vandestig. I'm the producer-director of My Run. And uh, we're, we're here to show our, our documentary at the Big Bear Lake International Film Festival. And I'm up here with my producing partners, Mark Castaldo and Christine Redlin. And uh, yeah, we're very excited. And give us a brief synopsis of what your film is about. Yeah. Well, our story, is, it's called My Run. It's the story of Terry Hitchcock, about a man that ran 75 consecutive marathons in 75 consecutive days at the age of 57, six months after having a heart attack. And he did this because he wanted to bring awareness to the struggle of single parent families. And uh, he became a single parent after his wife died of breast cancer. We have Billy Bob Thornton that narrated our movie. And um, we've just been doing the festival circuit. We started our festival circuit in uh, last year, in October. And we played at Austin Film Festival. We won Best Documentary and right. went to Mammoth Best Documentary. And since then, we've won uh, Best Documentary in eight, seven different cities. Now, is this the first film that you've directed? No. Now, this is actually my third feature. I've been doing film for about 20 years, making a living for about 15. And, uh, yeah, very excited about this project because what I've really noticed with this film is that um, audiences really have made that emotional and personal connection to the film because we all have lost people to cancer. We've all had obstacles in our life, and that's kind of what this film is about. It's not about a guy who j just run multiple marathons. It's about those marathons we all run in life. And then uh, was your film particularly expensive to make? 
Well, you know, that's that's a subjective kind of thing, you know. When you're an independent filmmaker, you're kind of like always working, you're always trying to, you know, raise money, you're always trying to market the film and distribute the film and whatever it takes, that's kind of the thing. I always can say, being an indie filmmaker is kind of like being a single parent. You have to wear so many different ty types of hats. And then, uh, what was your biggest challenge in making the film? Well, I, I think there's a lot of different challenges, but I also realize that when we approach these challenges, we, we find interesting things come from them. I mean, some other opportunities. You know, when you're an indie film, you know, financing is always hard. Um, you know, getting in the word of mouth out there and all that type of stuff. But by, by having those obstacles, it really challenges us to think outside the box, you know, outside the typical uh, world that we live in. And, uh, you know, I, I thank those kind of experiences. I mean, but again, it's, it's, it's a battle like with anything that you really want to do. Is this your first time coming up to the town of Big Bear? Yeah, I dig it. I dig it. <laughs> I dig it. I, it's, I'm originally from Minneapolis, Midwest town kind of deal, and uh, people are very down to earth. And I get the same kind of thing out here. A lot of uh, Midwest uh, type style of people, you know, handshake, you know, blue jeans, t-shirts. It's like, like at home. Blue collar place. Totally love it. <laughs> totally love it. All right. Well, I just wanted to thank you for answering my questions and welcome you to the film festival. Well, thank yeah. you very much. I just want to make sure that everybody knows that we're online at myrunmovie.com. We have a Facebook page with we have like 7,600 fans at facebook.com backslash myrunmovie. And, and the big thing I want to leave everybody with is that our core message with the film is be somebody's hero. And that's all we can do. Okay, we're at the Big Bear Film Festival, and I'm talking with the winners of the Audience Award for Best Documentary. Yeah. Hi, I'm Tim Banisteg. I'm the producer-director, along with Christine Redland. Hi, I'm Christine Redland, the co-producer and marketing supervisor. Hi, Mark Castaldo, the producer. Okay, tell us about your movie. Uh, My Run is an inspirational documentary. It's about Terry Hitchcock. Terry Hitchcock is a man that ran 75 consecutive marathons in 75 consecutive days at the age of 57, six months after having a heart attack. He did this because he wanted to bring awareness to the struggle of single-parent families, and he became a single-parent after his wife passed away of breast cancer. It's uh, Inspirational documentary narrated by Academy Award winner Billy Bob Thornton. This is now our eighth um, award at the festival circuit, and and right now what we're doing is we're just transitioning to the you know distribution phase coming up here. And our message really is all about be somebody's hero. That's really what it comes down to. Well, you you obviously touched a nerve because I've been hearing a buzz about this movie all weekend, and I hear the place was packed. So you did a great job in marketing yourselves as well. What's next for your movie? Uh, well, we're working on, of course, continuing the run with my run to get it through the ending festivals in November, and then we're developing the uh, DVD release and theatrical as well. Yeah, we have a few more uh, festivals coming up. We're going to be in uh, San Diego, uh, October 2nd and 3rd, the San Diego Film Festival. That's uh, Breast Cancer Awareness Month, and it's also Live Strong Day, October 2nd. And then we have, we'll be in Naples, Florida, and... Uh, that should be it, and then we'll uh, look for us January and February out in the theaters. All right. Thanks for talking with us. The award-winning production team of My Run.